Hello everybody. Today we're going to be making a whole day deals or an eye of God. This is a weaving craft that comes from the Hoichols, Native American people living in northwestern Mexico. Like me, you might not be as familiar with the Hoichol people as some other Native American tribes. They live in a mountainous area of Mexico. They are primarily farmers growing crops such as corn, beans, squash, and cucumbers. They are also known for crafts such as pottery and weaving. An ojo de dios is a simple weaving craft using yarn and popsicle sticks. The Holy Toy people would make these as a prayer to a Pacific God. They would hang them in a sacred place. Today, making an ojo de dios and giving it to a friend is seen as a way of wishing them well. What we're going to be doing is we take two popsicle sticks and we make an X. And I have actually glued these, but that's not necessary. I just did that to make it easier. And so we're going to take yarn and we're going to wrap it around the popsicle sticks. And if you don't have popsicle sticks in hand, you can use sticks or pencils or anything like that. So I take the yarn behind the X here and I'm going to wrap it twice like this. And then I turn and wrap it twice like this. And this is just to secure the sticks in this pattern so you can start the actual weaving. So I go one, two, then I turn, one, two, and I turn, one, two, and you just keep doing that. And don't worry about the string, you can cut it later. And you want to keep pushing the yarn down as you go. One, two. And this is a fast and easy craft for young kids to make. I used to make these all the time. If you want to, you can even change colors partway through. All you have to do is cut the yarn and tie on the new yarn. And then you can just cut the ends of the strings later. And so we're just going to keep going for a few minutes. All right, so now what I'm going to do is I'm going to change colors. You see, I simply just took the new yarn and I just tied the two strings together. And then we're just going to keep wrapping. And so now you're going to see the yellow. And if you're helping a younger child and they had trouble getting this started, I have gotten it started for them before myself. And then they're really enthusiastic and they'll keep it going. It's just getting the rhythm of it. And all I'm doing is I'm going over and I'm looping over twice. One, two. Push it down and then go over one, two, and just keep turning it. And I did remember one time someone got upset because they messed it up. No problem. It's very simple. Just unravel it and start over. In fact, I have been known to do this where I just make one and I like doing it so much I just unravel and keep doing it. And you can do this with thicker yarns and bigger sticks too. You don't have to initially do it with this. And I saw someone one time who actually did it with more than just the four point. So if you really want to get fancy, you can do other things. But this is the, the standard basic like eye of God, which is what my favorite shape is. And so what I've always made. Okay, so I think we are about done. All right, this is one that might get a little interesting. I'm going to cut off a really long string here and then wrap it around and then just tie it around the last stick and then I tie basically tie me a little loop there you go and so there's your eye guide and you can hang it in any window you want that's it for now I hope that you enjoyed making them as much as I did. And be sure to check out some of our other programs for Native American History Month, including some of our weaving programs. Thank you so much.